Hello and welcome back to another video. In this problem, we're told to let f of x equal x squared plus 1 if x is less than 1, and f of x equal x minus 2 squared if x is greater than or equal to 1. So for part a, we have to find the limit as x approaches 1 from the left of f of x, and the limit as x approaches 1 from the right of f of x. So for this, if we're approaching 1 from the left, That means that we have values of x that are less than 1. Therefore, we're using this top definition of this piecewise function. So this is the limit as x approaches 1 from the left of x squared plus 1. There's no weird domain restriction, so we can just plug in 1 directly. 1 squared plus 1 equals 2. The limit as x approaches 1 from the right means we're dealing with values that are greater than 1. So we're using this definition for x is greater than 1. So this is equal to the limit as x approaches 1 from the right of x minus 2 squared. Therefore, we, again, we just plug in 1 directly, 1 minus 2 squared. This is negative 1 squared, which is 1. And since the limit as x approaches 1 from the left and from the right do not match, they're not the same value, no, the limit of x approaching 1 of f of x does not exist. We're also asked to sketch a graph of f, which we could do. 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, and so on. So we have the basic function, the quadratic, y equals x squared. And we have two separate functions here. So x squared plus 1, again, using the transformations we learned in the last chapter, means we move up one unit. And x minus 2 squared means we move to the right um, one unit, or sorry, to the right two units. Now this looks like a mess, but then we draw our domain restrictions in pen. So we have x squared plus 1 if x is less than 1. So that is here, x is at 1, open circle, we fill in the rest. And then for x is greater than 1, for um, this function right here, so um, that is this point right here, and it's like that. And I didn't do a great graph of it because it almost looks like intersecting, um, but that's the general idea of the graph. Wish I could have done a better job, but that's okay.